Good morning, everyone. It is Monday in New York City. The for doing day today, but your office will be a good start. Forward to a busy week. Let's go to the office. All right, I may be the uh, biggest idiot in the world. I just ordered a pizza about 15 minutes ago that I have to pick up and I had no idea that it's a monsoon outside right now, but pizza better be worth it. Okay, voice memo mode is activated. Wednesday was a fun day. After work, I got some happy hour drinks with my coworkers, and then my friend and coworker, Colleen, actually had a show in a bar in Hell's Kitchen. So we all went there to support her. She is an amazing singer. Um, I'll show you some clips of her actually singing in a, in a second, but really just wanted to give her a shout out. I think it's so cool that she was following a dream and here she is. So yes, as you could imagine, that was a ton of fun and just felt like one of those innately New York City experiences. So that brings us into Thursday. Thursday really didn't do much, but wanted to give a quick shout out to Ann Caller because I am rocking their pants in this video and I'm just so blown away by these. They're so comfortable and light, but still look very professional. So those have definitely been my go-to pants when I go into the office in the New York City heat this summer. But again, Thursday was just a grinding day, spent a lot of time in the office, but was very productive and always feels good to close the week out on a good note. Although we did still have work on Friday, believe it or not. Um, but yeah, Friday I decided to work from home. I just had a few things, you know, housekeeping items to get done around the house. So took advantage of that flexibility and worked from home. All right, hey everyone, it is now Friday evening. It is 5.40. I am running out now to go to Hillstone, which is a popular restaurant here in New York. I'm going with Maddie. And then after that, we are catching a musical. We are seeing Shucked, which is actually a really popular um, musical here. I've won some, some Tonys, I think. So looking forward to that. Today, I worked from home and it was one of those days when you think it's going to be chill and then it is not. And I had a bit of a fire drill, but... We are done now, knock on wood, and now it is time to enjoy the weekend. So let's go. Hello, good afternoon, everybody. It is now about 4.30 on Saturday. Been a productive day so far. Last night was fantastic. Shucked was honestly amazing. I think I could probably say it was my favorite show I've seen so far while living here in New York. Hamilton is still by far the number one, but um, uh, in the last year, Shucked definitely takes the top spot. So that was a lot of fun last night. Also went to Hillstone. A great time there. But today was like I said, very productive, did a lot of GMAT stuff. I am 
pretty close to taking the exam now. Um, so I'm really ramping up my study, which is a good thing and a bad thing because it's just a lot of effort. But um, today I had a review test and I did, I exceeded where I was supposed to get um, in terms of the target score for that. So I'm really happy about that. It makes me feel a little bit more comfortable with this enhanced timeline that I'm working with right now. But that's enough of what I did. Let's talk about what I'm going to do. Tonight, we are heading out to Yankee Stadium for the first leg of the Jonas Brothers concert tour. Booked these tickets a few months back and honestly forgot about it until Maddie reminded me yesterday. So looking forward to seeing that. I'm not really the biggest Jonas Brothers fan, but you know I'm sure there will be plenty of nostalgia in the building. So looking forward to that. And honestly, just I'm sure it'll be a fun time. A few of my other friends are going. So shout out to Olivia and Dom. But with that said, I'm looking rough, so I'm going to take a shower, get cleaned up, and I will see you at the stadium. So before the concert, Maddie and I went over to Olivia's place, and then from there, walked to Grand Central. The stadium is in the Bronx, but fortunately, the four took us right there. Um, but it dropped us out right with a swath of people. Um, getting in was a bit of a hassle, but once we were in, it was totally worth it. Like I said later on in the video, actually, I haven't been to many concerts, especially none at a scale like this. I mean, this is Yankee Stadium and, you know, the field is completely packed. I mean, there it was really incredible. Um, and everybody else there seemed to know all the songs more than I did. Um, so it was really cool to be a part of that environment. Everybody was definitely loving the moment. I am not going to play any of the music just because I want to be able to monetize this. But just know it was a lot of fun. It was all five albums in one night. So it was kind of a lot. I actually left a little bit early. Uh, but yeah, that was a ton of fun. And that is what then brought us into Sunday. Hey, what's up, everybody? It is now... Sunday afternoon. I'm running to get my coffee and my bagels. The same I do every single day, but it is a beautiful day here in New York. Definitely taking advantage of it. Last night was a ton of fun at the Jonas Brothers concert. Don't go to too many concerts, but I might have to make a switch because that was a lot of fun. But anyway, having a productive Sunday here and getting the fuel to get me through the next few hours. Let's go. And fuel me it did. Uh, really been loving my Pret subscription lately, as you guys know. Later in the afternoon, I went back to Olivia's and hung out with my friends there. They wanted to be on camera. Anoush likes to think that the videos with him perform better, but I think the last few in London would beg to differ. But this is just Olivia's place, um, really a super nice spot. Then in the evening, Maddie and I decided to run down um, to Madison Square Park. I now realize how goofy people look when running, but honestly, it was a lot of fun. It was only about a mile and a half, so it was pretty easy after running a half marathon, subtle flex. But because we ran, we felt that we deserved some good pizza, so we went to Unregular Pizza, ate it right there in the park, and then we actually got Cafe Pana, um, which is a very famous spot here in New York. It was delicious, and that is how we closed out the week. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really appreciate the support on all of these vlogs and just all of the videos. I am so grateful to be able to, to document my life and that some people actually pay attention and care. So that means the world to me, and I will see you in the next video. Peace.